Hey guys, it's Carter. Welcome back to the Best Investing Money Management channel on YouTube. I hope you guys are all having a great and an amazing day today. In today's video, we are diving in and looking at a very, very special stock, ticker symbol TSM, also known as Taiwan Semiconductors. Now, this company over the past couple of years has seen extreme growth. It's gone from lows here all the way down at $11, hitting highs at 142 bucks, which is which is an absolute crazy, crazy return, outperforming all of those indexes, Dow Jones, NASDAQ, S&P 500. And what we've seen over the past couple of months, the stock has gone from 142 and it's sold off down to $80 a share, which is super, super affordable. This has caused the legendary investment Warren Buffett, his company Berkshire Hathaway to invest $4.1 billion into this company, which is which is quite a lot, which has caused today a lot of retail investors like myself to look at this company and say, what on earth is going on? And maybe there's some opportunity here. So guys, I hope you guys all enjoy it. So that's kind of talk about what's going on and answering that question of should you buy this company? So the first thing I do notice is the trend right now is your friend, right? Looking at it, we do have heavy selling pressure, and this is because it we've seen some uh, earnings reports come out. So they brought in about twenty point two billion dollars on this earnings, and about eighteen on this earnings, and about seventeen on this earnings. Not to mention, I really think right now in the semiconductor world and graphics cards, computers, what what we've seen is just so much sell off from other companies like ticker symbol AMD, which is a, you know, advanced micro devices, we've seen crazy sell off. And yet the company is still doing very, very well on their earnings. We have companies like NVIDIA, which is a very similar situation. So I really think right now, this is such an undervalued point for this stock, because the company is actually doing very strong on their numbers, right? Bringing in money, increasing revenues. And on top of it, they have one of the highest, highest profit margins out of any company I've seen in quite some time. So looking at it here, we'll, we'll go ahead and just pull it up here. So the net profit margin is up 21% and that's 45.8%, meaning for every $100 this company brings in, they profit 45 bucks, plus the revenue is up 47%. The only thing I think we've missed is the EPS, which is earnings per share. This is one of the main reasons I believe as well why we've seen a little, little sell-off from this, not as much but um, some sell-off from it is just a miss on the EPS. But the diluted EPS, earnings per share, is up 79%. Net income is up 79%. So there's there's so many solid metrics for this for this company. And one of the most important things when you know evaluating a stock, for me at least, is understanding is under pretty much understanding the company. Where do we see computer parts going in the future? Do you think we are just getting started? Do you think we're undervalued? I think each and every day we are getting more and more depend de- dependent on computers, computer parts, all that stuff, right? Everybody uses a phone. Everybody uses a computer nowadays. So I think for me, TSM is an absolute for sale sign to to start investing or at least start that process of dollar cost averaging would be a great idea. Just because you don't have to, uh, you don't have to, you know, worry about it going going out of business anytime soon. And also, this is considered a growth stock in all metrics, right? On the increasing, um, increasing, you know, revenues, uh, the very, very vol- high volatility, um, but the price to earnings for this is seventeen, which is extremely, extremely affordable. So, anytime, at least for me, that this stock has fallen under, you know, probably a twenty-five or a thirty on the price to earnings represents a for sale sign to start that process uh, of investing. Now, right now, we'll probably see a little sell off from this stock. We'll, it'll probably fall from 81 back down to probably 79 or 78 bucks over the next couple of weeks. But I guarantee we'll slowly start this thing, start seeing this thing getting bought up, um, especially with Warren Buffett behind it, guys. So that's kind of what's going on with this company. And answering that question of should you buy it, for me, it's an absolute no-brainer, right? I'll start that process, dollar cost averaging, investing maybe on a weekly, monthly basis into the stock, um, keeping it under probably two, 
three percent of my portfolio size just so just so i'm not super heavy and if it tanks i'm out a lot but i always can buy more so i hope you guys all enjoy the video that's what's going on with the company we'll see you guys later remember to stay happy stay positive and i hope you guys have a great rest of your day take care